I honestly don't know what month this box is. Let's call it June. I don't really know, but we're gonna get into it. Brown sugar box. Brown sugar box. newly me if you are new here but if you're one of my subbies hey too bestie so we about to get into this brown sugar box haul you already know what it is i have a whole playlist of these type of videos if you like stuff like this if you are a fan of brown sugar box if you want to know about brown sugar box i will go ahead and link the playlist and you can look at all of the months subscriptions that i got the box and what i got in them i think this is my god i don't want to say two and a half years might be a little bit more um, of being subscribed to this box. If you don't know about Brown Sugar Box, chow you should, but let me let you in on a little bit of it. It is a black subscription box dedicated or meant for, better wording, meant for black women. A lot of subscription services like Etsy and things like that, not saying they discriminate against black people, but a lot of the products, they're not really for us. Whereas Brown Sugar Box caters to us, so. I love to support black owned businesses and things that are meant for people of my heels. Here's your eels. And y'all, I have two brown sugar boxes. I'm gonna do the next video tomorrow. I'm not even sure which month this is. We are currently in the month of June. So we just gonna call this June box, okay? This one actually is a little smaller than most boxes, but y'all know that Great things come in small boxes, so I'm not even mad at that, okay? Well, the first thing I get out is my Jet Magazine. I'm trying to see what month this is. May. So it's actually the May edition. And we have a beautiful queen in her hat. I always have wanted a big floppy hat for the beach. I have to invest in one of those because every time I see somebody really cute in one of these hats, I'm like, why you don't have one of these hats? I'm like, girl, I don't even know. But I'm going to go ahead and get one. But anyway. Whenever you get your brown sugar box, you definitely wanna pick this up first. It's actually gonna tell you in detail everything in the box and the retail value of it. There's always cute little articles. Sometimes there are playlists. Yes, the Jet Beauties. I love this aspect. They always put their customers who wear the merch, you always get a t-shirt and post. When they post a picture on social media, there's a chance that you get to be in the Jet Magazine. I really like that aspect of this. Oh my God, I'm so happy. I, okay. I'm an admin reader. Me and Tony are both. I love autobiographies. I love cozy mysteries. That's like a whole little genre. I think it's like for old people, old ladies, but I'm an old lady heart. So I love my cozy mysteries. I love suspense. I love fiction. I like to read and I love that they sometimes give us books written by black women. Like, so here's a prime example, y'all, Miss Viola Davis, and I love her. Oh my God. I think she needs her flowers. She is one of the best actresses of all time, hands down, top tier. I will fight y'all in the comments if y'all say different. She is so slept on. Her range, child, I'm talking about she was on SVU uh, playing the lawyer. She was on How to Get Away with Murder, The Help. Like, y'all be sleeping on my sis. I can't wait to read this, but yeah. Book is an outfit of some sort. It looks like a button up. I actually have a short set with this same pattern. So I'm interested to see what this is. I think it might be a cute little romper. Yes, and it's a cute little button up shirt. If you can tell, I don't know if you can, it's just um, a black woman and her ponytail. And there's also a black woman with a fro, one with a beehive. So this is cute. I would rock this. I don't think I would button this. I think I would wear this with like a, maybe one of these colors, like a pale pink or a pale blue, like a spaghetti strap shirt with some jeans or some shorts. I would not wear this button up, but this will be a cute little, you know, have you a little tank top underneath, 
have it open with some jeans. That's very cute. You can even dress this up with maybe some nude heels. Girl, stop it. Let's see, is this a wallet? This is cute. Girl, this is a wallet. Sorry, have it upside down. This looks like my homegirl Shalonda, I promise you. I have to show her this. But this is cute. Yes, a cute little wallet. I love stuff like this. Okay, I thought this went all the way down, but zip up part here on the top. You also have this here. And then for all your cards. Is there a spot? And there's a spot right here. This is very cute. I already have two wallets, but this would be a good like travel wallet. When I do travel, I just don't, I don't know why, I don't like taking all my cards and everything. I just like to get a certain select few out. So this will probably be good for traveling because I don't like to take my designer, look at me sound like a snob, designer. I don't like taking my designer bags when I travel. I don't know why, I just don't. Child, and they just loaded up on clothes and you know, merch this time this looks like a t-shirt always get a t-shirt in your brown sugar box okay you will always get a t-shirt oh this is cute okay so it's a t-shirt and you have three pretty queens on it i think this is so cute even if you are not a t-shirt person okay let's talk about that for a minute some of us are not some of us is you know some of my besties y'all little sadiddy out there and that's, there's nothing wrong with that do you work out some black leggings, sis. Go get your workout on. Or if you're anywhere, uh, anything like me, I have house clothes, clothes that I wear up in this house. I wouldn't necessarily wear outside, but they're not pajamas. They're just solely house clothes. Girl, throw you on a t-shirt, the little biker shorts, are your tights, clean your house up, do about your business. But I'm just saying, even if you're not the type of person that wears t-shirts outside, you always need t-shirts in my opinion. This is very cute. I'm not a pink girl, but this is very cute. I think this is the last item. Is this a bag? Now, let me tell you how I have gotten a duffel bag from Brown Sugar Box. I have got a cute little like, I don't even know what to call it. They look like those like grocery bags that are you can collapse it within itself that I use for traveling all the time ever since I got it just to have an extra bag when you go shopping and you're out of town I've gotten a cute little um laptop case they be coming through with the bags y'all these are traveling bags please hold if you know me if you know me you know the girls that get it get it the girls do, that don't get it don't get it if you don't know me, if you are new to this channel, I am like a packing expert, okay? And one of my essential items that I use to pack are packing cubes, okay? If you have not heard of pack packing cubes, I need you to use Google immediately and get you some because it will change your life. And these folks at Brown Sugar gave me packing cubes. They gave me packing cubes, y'all. Yes, okay. So one, two, three, four, five packing cubes. Now, I am a person that compartmentalizes everything from my purse to my bags to my home. So this is excellent for me. Packing cubes literally, and I'm not being sarcastic, they literally maximize your space in whatever suitcase from a carry-on to like, a five gallon suitcase like child like small or big you'll maximize what you get to bring it if you are an overpacker like your girl these are essential because i need options okay i need options i'm not the oh i'm aware that one day i need four maybe three four different options for a day yes that's extra deal with it i'll usually have one bag for like all of my casual outfits. I have a whole bag for like my undergarments and um, you know, nightgown. I have another one for like hair, like you get what I'm trying to say? So they have given us five, not y'all, not us, me, cause I ain't sharing. They have given us five packing cubes. So here's the largest one. And if you can see, 
it is a black woman with the afro which i love i like the color too it's like a mustard it's coming off orange because i can't stand orange but it's like a mustard color that i'm feeling so we have the large one and then we have the second to large one and these look small y'all but if you roll your clothes you can get some outfits okay I went to Denver for my birthday and we ended up having a COVID scare so we didn't get to go as many places. Tell me why your girl had about 12 different outfits and we were probably only gonna be there for like four days. I had 12 different outfits packed with ease, y'all, because I had packing cubes. But anyway, this is the third biggest and you can also kind of use this as a, um, if you got some fancy shoes, put those in here. And then they came with these two pouches. Now, especially because it's summertime, you're going somewhere, I would use one of these for like my bathing suit because like when you get it wet, you don't want that mildew smell to go throughout your luggage. So maybe the little one could be for your wet items. Maybe this can be for your hair care. You know, if you're African American, you have bonnets, you have scarves, you have, girl, put it all in here. That way when you go in the bathroom, you get your change in your routine. Boom, just bring your bag. I'm telling you, pack and food will change your life also i like how they have the mesh this is essential when like i said like if you go somewhere for the summer you're doing a lot of water activity or girl if you're musty you've been walking around you musty when you put your clothes back up you want your clothes to be able to breathe okay you don't want to open the bag and knock yourself out with the fumes i'm just saying Mesh is always better than having solid on all sides. Even if you don't get this from brown sugar and you just go out and get your own packing cubes, keep that in mind. I would suggest supporting a black owned business and get yours from Lizzie and Live. I'm just saying, but packing cubes. Hey y'all, I really, really liked this box. I think this is top tier, one of my favorite boxes. So just to recap, I have a brand new book that I'm going to devour probably this weekend by the legendary Viola Davis, Finding Me. We got a cute wallet, which I'm going to dub as my traveling wallet. Love it. We got a cute little button up. And you know what, actually, that might be too country. But remember I told y'all I have like, um, I'll put a picture, but it's like a spaghetti strap shirt and shorts that matches pattern. I don't know if that's too much of a pattern, Maybe I can wear a white tank top with the shorts that match this with this unbutton. That might be cute. But anyway, we got a button up shirt, y'all. We have a cute graphic t-shirt with three planes on it. And we have packing cubes, a five piece set packing cubes. I am so impressed with this, y'all. If y'all know me, my friends that know me in real life, I am giddy right now, okay? I have another set of pack of cubes. But anyway, that is the video. If you enjoyed it, give this video a thumbs up so YouTube can push my pretty brown videos out there for everyone to see. Go ahead and leave me a comment below. Which one did you like the best? I have to say it's a tie between the book and pack of cubes. And I know y'all are crazy like, girl, they just pack of cubes. Girl, they will change your life. Stop playing. But anyway, which was your favorite? Have you tried brown sugar? Do you want to? There's also a referral link. I do not get paid for these videos, although I think I should be getting a little bit of a coin. But that's neither here nor there. If you want to try brown sugar box, there's a referral link below. You'll get a discount on your first box. I'll get a discount on my next box. It's a win-win situation. That'll be in the description box below, as well as I'll put the website, because someone else asked me my last brown sugar video for the actual website. I'll leave that link so everything is just super easy and quick for y'all. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you made it this far, leave me a comment below and say hi. Until next time, y'all. Bye.